my dresser kitties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a puppy to celebrate Halloween. So let's get started. To draw this cute dog, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a circle. Not too big, just a small circle. And I'm going to come right next to it, say about this way, and draw another circle. And now with my circles in, I'm going to come to the top right here and draw another circle for a highlight and shade everything else in. And same thing over here. From there, let's come in between the eyes and about right here, we're going to draw the nose. So I'm just going to draw this big curve, give our puppy a big nose, and round off the sides, and then connect in the center. And then I'll give it a little highlight right here at the top, and shade everything else in. There. And now I'll come above each eye before I forget, and just draw a soft curve. And then let's come back to the center right here at the bottom and we're going to draw a straight line down and then we're going to curve up on both sides. So let's come right here and curve up, cap it off to make a very happy puppy and cap it off. Oh, so cute already, right? And you can leave it like this or if you want, you can have a tongue sticking out. If you want to do that, let's just come right by here and we're going to pop out this little tongue and just draw a little line right in the center. And then right here, we're just going to close it up with a curve. And let's see here. Do I want to shade that part? And I'll just shade it in so you can see a little bit better. There. Okay, so then from there, we're going to have to start to frame the face. So let's come back to the center of your eye. Let's come out. Let's say about this much. Not too much, just a little bit of the center of your eye. Come out about right here. And we're going to start with a curve. So I want to bring this curve down to go around the face. So it's going to be pretty long because we need to bring it all the way down here. So let's come down to the center of your tongue. Come out uh, just a little bit, not too much. Give yourself a point. And this is where your curve is going to go. So it's like a bottom of a U. But before I finish this curve, if you're using a pencil, just go ahead and connect all the way and then to and then go ahead and draw the paw but i need to stop about right here so right underneath this eye i'm going to come about right here and pop out a paw so right underneath that eye i'm going to come right here and then about right here connect it with three curves and then just add a little line right here so same thing here just like the other side Two and three. There. Okay, so we have two of these, and then now whatever space you have left, go ahead and just finish it off. Right here at the bottom. There. Okay, so then from there, we're going to bring this curve up a little bit more and come in. So a little bit above the brow area and bring it in. Now we're going to start to draw the top. So just kind of imagine we're just going to, let's say about right here. I'm just going to go ahead and start the top of my dog's head. So about right here, towards the center, and then bring it down. There, just drawing a big curve above, and then we're going to start the ears about right here. So we're going to pop it out a little bit and then bring it out. And then in this space, we're going to come down and about right here, go ahead and bring it out. So we just want to create these floppy ears and then bring it in and connect there. These cute little puppy ears, right? I'm going to just pop it out a little bit more now that I'm looking at my camera. Make it a little bit bigger. Okay, so same thing here. Just want to pop it out about right here. And pop this part out. 
open and bring it in and connect there. Just take a look. I'm going to make the head a little bit taller. Sorry for the mess. <laughs> okay, so now we finally have that in. Okay, so then from there, let's go ahead and we're going to use this curve right here to draw the little oval, the opening of our pumpkin. So just imagine this is coming through. You're drawing an oval. And about right here, I'm just going to draw a little curve. So same thing. Just imagine a little oval right here. And connect there. Then let's come back right here. And we're going to pop out this big pumpkin. Same thing here. Nice and big. Okay, so now that we have that shape in, you can draw your pumpkin however you like, right? Uh, but I'm going to make mine really big and round. So let's come right here. And let's see, let's keep going. And I'll, I'll bring it in. Uh, right here. Okay, so in about here, I'm going to bring it in. And I'm just going to go ahead and put in one towards the center, another curve, just to give our pumpkin some ridges. And another one right here to connect for our bottom. And here. Okay, so then from there, let's go ahead and bring this pumpkin to life. So now we're going to put in some draw so cute eyes. So let's come right here. We're going to draw a big circle. But of course, this is meant to inspire you. So you can draw whatever pumpkin face you want. But hopefully you like my draw so cute eyes and you put that too. <laughs> Okay, so now we have a huge circle in. Let's go ahead and make them draw so cute eyes. So two small circles inside for highlights and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. This is going to take a while because these eyes are so big. and lines at the bottom. Okay, so same thing over here. Okay, finally. So now that we have the eyes in, let's come above each eye. We're just going to draw a soft curve. And then in between, uh, let's just draw a little triangle for a nose. I was tempted to put a heart in there, but nah, let's just make it nice and simple, right? So a little triangle and then let's draw a big smile. So I'm going to come right here, put in some teeth, go up, put in another one and up. So just a little smirk smile for our pumpkin. And let's go ahead and widen it up. Nice and wide and say about right here we'll add another tooth for the bottom layer and connect there. And so let's see here what else. Are, oh so um, that is pretty much it but I thought it'd be really cute if you wanted you can put a little top on our puppy. So right here, if you want to do that, just come right here and just put a little top of our pumpkin, little hat. It's a nice little big curve. And then right here, we're just going to put a little stem for our pumpkin. <laughs> there. And let's see here. we got to add a heart, right? So I'll add a heart right here on my pumpkin to make it my draw so cute puppy to celebrate Halloween. I really hope you love this sweet little drawing and that I helped you draw it fun and easy today. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw Secret videos. See you later.